Hello and welcome to Avenging Pass 7. This is day 302 of our free-to-play farming guide. I hope that you are doing well. Last night, Ahsoka Episode 3 came out, and if you have not watched it, you need to go watch it. It was, I think, the shortest episode that the season will have, so I believe all the rest are going to be longer than last night's. And they did what I said they should. I'm not going to go into spoilers, I promise. Um, but they did what I said they should. They should... With it being a short episode, they should really focus in on just one or two characters. Really focus in on character development. Uh, getting us to understand and get getting us to know who these characters are. And they did that. Um, I won't spoil who that character is, but I thought that they did a really, really good job with all of that. So... Definitely go watch it and know that I enjoyed it. And in a few days, I'll either have made a video specifically about Ahsoka, or I will have just talked about it after some time has passed. Oh, uh, what else has been going on? Um, it's been good. Let's see. The farming has been going good. I know it's going slow for me, but that's I'm okay with that. I'm okay with being behind. Um, I'm just trying to go through it. Let's see. Alright. Um, what else? I've loved reading a bunch of your comments with your thoughts on Ahsoka, with your thoughts on the, uh, great, uh, female characters in Star Wars. It's given me a ton of ideas, and I'm working on the script and working on fleshing all of that out and at least writing it down. Then I'm going to work on putting it all into a video. So I'm excited about it. Um, I do plan, you know, in case you missed the, that part of the episode, if I don't remember when in the episode I said it, but I do want to take this idea, this video idea of great female characters in Star Wars, and presented as a, at a like kind of panel discussion um presentation at momocon 2024 in atlanta so i'm gonna be pitching that to them you know once i have it ready once i have it on youtube um i'm then going to fill out the form and request that opportunity hopefully i get that because that would be very exciting and if so you know or if not either way i would hope that anyone who is possibly near Atlanta, Georgia. If you want to come down to Momocon and meet up, I will be there. Um, I had a ton of fun at Momocon last year. I plan to have a ton of fun at Momocon again. So, you know, I'm excited about that. Hopefully they get, you know, I'm waiting for them to start releasing their uh, list of guests and to see who they start, who they're going to have for meetups meet and greets again this year um maybe some clone wars characters clone wars voice actors that would be really cool um I'm trying to think who else would i love to meet from animation i don't really know i don't really know there, I'm, but i'm sure that there's some people that you know would be really cool to meet from animation that I mean, I got to meet Ashley Eckstein. That was awesome. James Arnold Taylor or um, Matt Lanter would be really cool to get to meet. Um, D, Bat D. Bradley Baker would be crazy to meet. He's voiced so many characters across the past 25 years. D. Bradley, D. Brad D. Bradley Baker would be really cool. Um, I can't remember if I talked about it, uh, but the alt account and the main account both unlocked uh, General Kenobi's capital ship, and so that's really cool. And Sierra Sonic, I know a few times you have mentioned that I really need to save up on the on the uh, prestige tokens, and you were right. I ran out of those so quickly on that ship, on the Negotiator. On this account, we're a bit further away from being able to get the Negotiator. I mean, we're not too far. Just 15 tokens. Just 15 shards. Um, but what is it? I think I got it up to 5 stars. 
at the initial unlock, and I spent all of my prestige tokens so quickly getting its that those abilities built up. It was crazy. Um, but I do have that ship on those accounts now, so now I'm trying to work, you know, build up that fleet, um, trying to get the Galactic Republic ships worth using. Um, most of them are pretty good, but, you know, they are lacking in a few spots. And, uh, like, not 7-star yet and all of that. So, I'm trying to get them there. Uh, let's see. Okay. Um, so, making good progress on the account. Making good progress on the YouTube channel. I'm having a good, fun time here. Um, trying to come up with some new ideas, new things to work on. Um, I think I'm going to try and watch A New Hope tomorrow night. I think tomorrow night will be a good night to watch A New Hope. And if we're able to, fantastic. Then we can start writing out and thinking through what we want to say in the video. And then get that posted. Or get that filmed, edited, and then posted. Um, so hopefully we're not too far away from that being out there for y'all to see and enjoy. Oh, let's see. Ships. Let's see. Let's upgrade that. Yeah, I mean we are lacking in the sh in the ships. Our ships are not that great. We definitely need to get our ships to be better. But that will happen over time, I guess. Um yeah, so I don't know. Today just might be a s small little video. I don't think I'm going too crazy. There's a bunch of stuff I want to talk about with Ahsoka, so I might just make an Ahsoka-centric video soon. Because, you know, I don't want to talk too much about it quickly after the episode drops, because a lot of people won't have... Even though it comes out at a much better time now, a lot of people still might not have the chance to have seen it just yet. So, we'll wrap it up there. I hope that y'all are doing fantastic. I hope that y'all are ready for Grand Arena. Uh, let's take a quick peek at who the opponent is today. Clone who punched a battle droid. I like it. Uh, let's see. 2.8 mil. It's not too bad. They have crew. So yeah, they're going after uh, SLKR, but they are not there yet. So they got two really good first order teams. Vader is has all three relics or all three Zetas, but he is not relict. They got Hondo built up. That's cool. They got resistance built up. Wampa's not gonna do them much good. Yeah, I mean so they got some teams. And with it being three V three, they're a bit better set up, but also it's only three V three. What about their ships? Yeah, they got some ships. Ooh, and they got the Radis and the Finalizer. Okay. Alright, so we'll see how that goes tonight. With all that said, I hope that you'll have a fantastic day. And may the Force be with you.